Bowling coach Jason Capperton was driving to practice, taking his normal route when he saw this apartment complex on fire, jumped out of his car, and quickly took action. Seeing a lady pretty frantic outside, see the smoke billing out of the building. Varsity bowling coach Jason Capperton says when he came across an apartment fire on the 1700 block of Goddard Monday afternoon, he knew he had to act quickly. Ran over, a few people were already coming out. Uh, opened the door, you can see it was pretty heavy already, pretty dark smoke. I was an employee at DT Energy for seven, eight years, so I'm used to emergency situations. Alyssa Mays and her son were on the second floor when she smelled smoke, her husband at a nearby store. I heard a bunch of stomping in the hallways and then the alarm started going off and something told me to check and I opened my door. It's all full of smoke, pitch black, can't see nothing. I got the phone call that the apartment was in flames. I hurry back. Alyssa is staying at a local hotel. The Red Cross and Salvation Army have assisted her and the other people who've been displaced from the fire. She says she remembers seeing Jason run into the apartment to try to battle the flames. He ran into the apartment, grabbed the fire extinguisher, and started trying to uh, put the fire out. A DoorDash driver, I didn't get his name, he pulled in because he's seen all the flames and he let everyone sit in his car and warm up. Jason says the response that he's received is a little overwhelming and is hoping the community will come together to help these families out. As of right now, you know, every family that was in there is pretty much without everything they had. And if you'd like to help out, we have information posted on our website, WXYZ.com. In Lincoln Park, I'm Alan Campbell, 7 Action News.